rooftops of Savannah. I was an asshole, but he was my friend. You immediately have to have this in for us. These are poor Paris's four friends. I understand. We're a group. This is a shitty time, but I want to clear something up. What is it? Now with Kenny gone, and Omid and I have to say something for her. We do our best. You know that. What's going on? I just saw your friend get killed. You mean four? Back at the attic? It's nothing. What's nothing? Let's just keep moving. Hmm. Do we trust that? Or is Lee going to fall to his death? Probably not, because we still have more chapters in this episode to do. I don't know why I have to look down. Ugh. Step on the boards. There you go. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. We made it. Yeah, Lee's not in a really funny mood right now. Hey, an achievement. Mercy. Sacrifices were made. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of walkers. Marshall's hotel in Donald Corleone. It doesn't look like a death trap. Uh huh. Who's going first? I have a leg. These guys busted it open. We're gonna cut them too. Now we gotta see what's good this time. Stick with me, Zoe. You two should go. Oh, please tell me I didn't send them to their deaths. I'll follow right after. Please tell me I didn't send them to their deaths, please. Nothing please make it. About Kong. I didn't doubt you. I appreciate you. And he hinted that she's walking for two, that she's pregnant, but I don't think that's ever come up. I mean, it's something that I suspect, but... I don't know that it's ever come up in the conversation. Krista, you next. Oh. All right, well, Lee, you gotta find your own way. What are you gonna do? Uh. Can you help me? I don't know what we can do from here. Anything. It's fucked, Lee. Sure. And we've taken risks before. For it. Going for it? What does that mean? It means I'm already bitten. I just have to push my way through. The fuck? Uh. I mean, yeah. let's meet outside of town by the train. Are you nuts? It's the only way. Do you hear me? Yeah, by the train. Jesus, we we'll be there. Well, I should have taken the boat because Kenny would be by the boat, right? I don't mind 
Maybe. I'm one of you now. Oh, fuck. Crap. You're not gonna cut it open. Well, they're drawn to the blood. So why'd you do that? Fuck. One. Love this meat cleaver. Yeah, you're out of the way. I hit the button. a little too close for me. Oh! Boy, he lost his head. Ow! That's one sharp meat cleaver. Probably smell like him now. Ah! <sighs> Achievement, the Marsh House. Arrived at your destination. Covered in yuck. Alright, Clem, where are ya? Can't get into that door. You're going to that door automatically, huh? Um, I'm going to listen first. I didn't hear anything. I didn't go in anyway. Tap it. You son of a bitch. You gotta keep joining me in. Where is she? I already told you she's fine. Not with you, she's not. Go over there. Quiet, please, sweetie. Don't Your you thing. call her sweetie. There. Um. This is all I've got. Okay? Yeah, where's that meat cleaver hiding? Probably gonna get me in trouble. No, I'm not touching you. Just sit down. All right, so I kept my meat cleaver and my thing of glass. Now we're gonna have a civilized conversation. I don't remember the question. You know who you are. I'm you sorry. Your father. I'll find him. Do you see anything else? Everything was just out there for the taking. We were starving. For the taking? Do you know what you took from me? Oh, so he's the guy that in the car that ran out of gas or whatever. Keep yourself clear of your fool. 
That's right, you took my Clem. I rescued her from you. Don't you get that? <laughs> rescued. Asshole! Have you ever hurt somebody before? Um, sure. Not be talking about Clementine. I think I'm thinking of all my old friends. I was too young. I figured it wasn't me. I came back and Adam was all good all the time. She was like a monster. Yes, you are. Um, I'll be nice. Now on the way to Doc and Rachel's arena, until she finally took us out of the Whisper Tower. I figured you'd get far. Found me. I gave her a lift. From the road. Safety in numbers. Do I look like a monster to you? Yes. Yes, you do. We all are, kind of, I guess. Drama avoiding you. I know what that feels like. You killed a man with a pitchfork right in front of a little girl. Ah. Uh, I didn't want to hurt her. That's right. A defenseless, grieving woman. I was your boyfriend. The sweatshirt she's wearing was my boy. You stole that from us. I'm starving. It's cold. So my family starved in the cold. Yep. Did I fuck it up? Okay, no, he's not going to shoot me. Can't be that obvious. Is he following us? Or the radio? That's right, he's been talking to Clem. You're a monster. You're a murderer. You're a thief. And I want to hurt you so bad. <laughs> Show him your arm. Uh. Doesn't have to be this way. You can't take care of anyone. After I heard Clementine on the radio and realized who you were, I just started doing what I did. with me. I need you to hear this before this happens now. I can take care of you. No, you can't. No, you can't. Not with Clementine. You don't even know how old she is. She's eight. She told me. Wrong. She's nine. What? Her birthday is a six days from now. Oh, well, she didn't tell me her birthday. Dude, um, it's not. not in this world. She's going to see a lot of things that you can't control. You was crazy. Let's try one more time no. to be nice no. and civil. You're going away, and we're starting a new thing. Nope. The hell is he talking to? The bag. It's got somebody's head in there or something. Oh, Clementine! I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad. It's all over, honey. Isn't it? Does he love me? Does he have her hat? I know he picked it up. I miss you so much, honey. I miss you so much, Tess. You're gonna like Clementine a lot better. 
She's not lazy, but she's sweet. She's getting hurt. Oh, no, 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 no. Get your fingers out of my eyes. <sighs> Shit, where is he? Come on. Come on. Man, this is not going in at all. Come on. Oh, come on. Bitch. Nope. Nope. Die. In his eye? No, right above his eye. Good girl. I know that was hard for you, Clem, but good girl. It's okay. It's okay. <sighs> we got Clementine back, but now we gotta tell her we're bitten. You look horrible. <laughs> That's an understatement. Let's just get somewhere safe. <clears throat> Did he hurt you? No. Not really. I'm sorry, Minnie. It's okay. We will get you somewhere safe. Then we have to talk, okay? Yeah. Everything's okay now. You need to figure out Cover how hat? to get out of Savannah as fast as you can. Good thing I taught her how to shoot. And she's a good shot too. For a little kid. You weren't afraid. I was. And you did well. I know. I am now. Okay. Alright, um. Alright. That's a really long look at the guy. I don't see if there's anything of use in this room. You must be the only one in here. Yeah, there's nothing in there. Can we go? Yeah, of course. Um let's look what he had in the bag. I'm Pretty sure it's a head. Yeah. That's an eye. Can you look in there? No, I know. Alrighty. Then let's leave. Alright, let's not leave. Nope, nope, nope. Alright, we're out of ammo. Yeah. And now I'll get some sleep for once. Yeah, you're covered in all that junk stuff. I guess there was much more to get here. Them and then I'll goop and I'll oh crap. I'll oh, I'm gonna top this guy up, aren't I? Oh boy. All right, let's chop him. Oh, no. Sorry, Clem. You're you're such a little kid. You don't need to see something like this. I, f I feel for you. It's like sausage links, you know? <sighs> Sorry, Clem. Sorry, Clem. Oh, now you're all 
gross and filthy. Do some more so they don't come at you from behind. Are we done? One more. Gotta be sure. Yeah. She doesn't look very good. I thought it was gone. Not so fast. Thank you. Oh, happy birthday, Clem, too, by the way. For now, achievements. What's in the bag? Confronted a stranger. All right, well, at least I don't have to kill my way through this crowd. Just walk nice and slow. Okay, ramble on. Don't bump anybody. Oh, crap. You're messing up with my. Feel the view here, people. Let's uh, move over this way a little bit. Okay, yeah. This guy's gonna bump into me. Come bump into me. Yep, he bumped into me. Fuck. Oh, get your hands away. Nope, nope, stop. Move this color. Guy go in front of me. There we go. We'll let the... Oh boy, those are big boobs. It's your parents, isn't it? Achievement. Stay close to me. Wake up. Made it out, but I think I did. Please no. Please. I was so scared. I, I, I thought you loved me. Please. Yeah. I told my parents. No. Yeah. got away. They're dead for sure. How did they get away if he was passed out? We'll have to get out of here as fast as we can. But we can't. There's thousands of them outside. We have to. What's happening? There's no, food. no, that's crazy. I saved you. We're safe here. I locked us in. You can't get the door open. I can. Do it! His eyes are turning white yellow. when I found it. I told you to keep us safe. That was a good thing, except you don't know the whole truth. Oh, sorry. I hit the button. For some reason, I thought it would be a stick movement. Just lost your parents, um, <laughs> and now she's gonna lose I'm Lee. To take care of you. I, can't let her. I know. Starting to shamble around, just I like the walkers do. I think there might be a way out over there. What is this? What's he doing? I might be a bit slow. Faster. I'll help you. Alright. Alright. I got you. You 
Lean on me if you have to. I'm okay. I'm okay. I thought I was helping by bringing you in here. Um. I don't know how she did it either. Keep going. We're almost there. Okay, I'm at the end of the cabinet here. <laughs> Get up, Lee. The door is right here. Ah, uh, can you do it? Do it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, oh, pushing the button. I got here. You have to. I can't move. It's as if you were here. Please, please, try to get up. I'm going to try, Clem, for you. I'm going to try. I'm going to do this. I can get up. I can't get up. Um You'll have to keep away from me. But Lee Whatever you have to do to keep me away from you, you'll have to. Okay. You got yellowish orange eyes? I never noticed that before. Gonna be her. Uh, how do I? Well, let's talk to Clem. Don't worry. I'm doing good. Okay, apparently I can't talk to her that much. Baseball bat. The gun, Clem. You can use that. And smash the window. There's a guy in there, though. Is he stuck? Oh, I got rid of him, honey. Just look. He isn't. Not him at all. Okay, um... The way out's through there, Clem. I know. Well, okay, I can't... Chair, 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 Grab the handcuffs. Okay, Lee. You're all covered in stink, so he'll leave you alone, right? Okay. Sorry, Lee. Do it, sweetie. Make sure it's safe. I don't I don't want to do this. You have to. It's for your own good. I only have to do what's best. <laughs> and he's trapped, you, but you gotta get you know, under his um 
Under his arm reach. So he can grab her. Hey, Linda Dunn. Eyes are turning yellow. First. Keys. Um. Give me the keys. You have to make a run for it. Okay. Nope. <laughs> what the fuck you? Nope. Nope. No, I can't. I can only talk to him. There's nothing I can do. Oh, that I can do. Watch out! Is he gonna beat him in the head? Oh. Ah. Uh. Shit. What can I do? Uh. Again. Hit him again. Oh, okay. Now she's covered in more goop. I did it. I got him. You did. You can take care of yourself. See? No, not all the time. A nine year old with a gun. I'm going to have to decide to shoot him. You're strong, Kylie. You, you can do anything. But I'm little. Yep. Don't go so fast up. Damn it. I can. You have to shoot him, Kylie. Please, no. It's okay. It's okay. Here. I'm standing over Duck holding that gun. It's so hard. It's hard if you're in that position. I can do it. I can. Um. Uh, don't be here, Krista. You're outside of town. On the train. Back there? <laughs> yes. Good. Now take good care of him. Alright, I can give her more advice, right? Oh, Lee. Oh, Finally what? gotta do it. What is it? Don't, don't worry. I'm not going to see you again. Me too. Thank <laughs> you. 
You have to aim a little higher. I hope she got him. Yeah. All right. Um, an achievement. What remains? Completed episode five. Episode five was a short one. All right, so desperation. Remove Lee's arm. Wow, more people removed it. I'm a little surprised. Fallout lost the temper. You, uh, more people lost their temper with Kenny. Maybe I'm just a softie. Uh, gave up weapons. I kept my weapons. That's good. Uh, killed Clementine's captor. Didn't sixty-five. Didn't kill the stranger. How could I have killed her? If I take the meat cleaver out, maybe, when I attacked him? Uh, you and 60% of the major Lee didn't turn. Okay. I, I can deal with that. Alright, let's see. You defended Ben when he was accused of stealing. You stood up for Ben and Crawford. Ben fell to his death in a savannah alleyway. You asked Ben to help you find Clementine. You saved her life at the cost of another. You agreed with her to tell others about your past. She was killed by Lily. Yeah, that bitch. Uh, you helped her get onto the train. You hid your bite from her. You told her that Omid told her and Omid to meet you at the train. You asked her and Omid to take care of Clementine. And there's that that guy. You were with him when you found your brother. Oh yeah, that's the guy at the pharmacy. Attacked the drugstore. I saved Carly's life over him and I can't remember what was his name? I don't remember. You argued that he was not bitten back in Macomb. You let him be your sidekick and solve a mystery. You shot him before he could turn. Alright, Kenny. You defended his son in the drugstore. You talked him down from ignoring his son's fate. Uh, you killed his son so he didn't have to. He was lost to the to the herd trying to save Ben. Oh, she lost her. I don't know. I don't feel that Kenny died. For some reason, I think Kenny had a, a chance to get out. Uh, you found water for a duck when he needed it. She shot herself when faced with her son's death. Uh, Larry, you call him a racist. Yes, I did, because... He is, and he's a prick. He re tried to revive him with CPR. Yeah, I did. Even though he's a, a prick, I did try to revive him. The dairy. Uh, Lily, you backed her up when supplies went missing. You chose to reveal your past to her. You left her on the side of the road. I did that. Um, hopefully, she's still alive. You were separated after the they crossed the sign. Not a whole lot with Omid. So that is season one of The Walking Dead. There's no time left is this chapter. So that is the game. We'll look at the achievements. And we didn't perfect the game because in this we also have, if we scroll all the way down here, we have the 400 days as well. So we have Vince's chapter, Wyatt's, Rust of Bonnie the Shells, and the epilogue, and then these two other achievements. I don't know um, where they fit in and everything. So I don't know if I will capture these chapters in the 400 days and post them or not. Um, I might just do them on my own. But that is season one of The Walking Dead for the month of October. I hope you uh, enjoyed watching me play this game. We only lost my decisions after episode two, I think it was, when we tried to start three. I think that's when the system lost all my choices. But 
the choices it made for me were very similar to what I had already done. Um, other than the fact that it said that Larry knew who I was and I never told Larry I lied to him. Um, but it was pretty close. So I think we got the ending or the parts of the story that I would have picked on my own had those decisions carried over. So I want to thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this game and maybe picked it up for yourself. And who knows, maybe next year for October I'll play Season 2. Maybe by then Season 3 will be out. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. But I want to thank you guys for watching and I hope you stick around for the rest of the videos for the month of October and the Halloween themed month and then you continue on and see what I do in November. So, bye guys!